thought that the the world is going to end because of water or war bombs all over nah just a small thing a virus just a virus ng it's just going to end everyone same goes to financial freedom you don't need much you just need to be smart then that's it just need to be smart then that's it you know so i know it's tough hustlers it's tough having to deal with these haters who are always criticizing our industry all the time but i can assure you as your leader i'm not going anywhere as your leader i am not going anywhere as your leader i am not going anywhere they will talk talk and talk i ain't going anywhere i'm not going anywhere i will not stop inspiring you because of this haters and i can assure you whatever they say about us about me they always say it online physically not even one person tell me how do you get off a picanto a bus to swear at the person who's driving a g class who are you eh who are you to do so you see these people they just talk from a distance so just make sure that you you are able to have a big heart to take everything that they say and then turn it into something positive to change your life then when you are on top you, they are going to talk about me and you now they are going to tell people how you have changed on them they are going to tell people how you are doing this scam things which don't even exist but trust me it's it's it doesn't affect you it won't affect you it only affects you now because you haven't you haven't seen success but once you see success trust me none of these things which people say will ever affect you none of them i mean like you you can't tell a person who's driving a g class nonsense physically there are levels to this life thing man you know there are levels so traders let's let's push uh, let's push i know it's tough for you guys every day it's tough critics from celebrities your family members your girlfriends your, your boyfriends your partners in general i know but trust me as your leader in the industry this is the future even coronavirus knows that we are here to stay as traders they can kill us it can kill us it can kill me but trading itself ain't going anywhere so regardless of the challenges you come across just don't give up guys uh, just keep on pushing man keep on pushing i would actually suggest that you you trade in 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 secret in secret simply means that you don't necessarily announce to your friends that you're actually into trading just keep quiet about it push before you sleep think about what you want what you want for yourself what you want for your life you know when i was still studying in varsity uh, in 20 actually around yeah 2015 somewhere around 2015 when i was still in varsity before i knew about the whole industry every day when i was walking at harangwa going to campus i was actually seeing myself living in a nice house seeing myself driving a nice car right but the only problem around that time was that i didn't know how to get there i had no idea so basically i was daydreaming daydreaming sometimes helps because it keeps your focus it keeps your passion you know so i used to dream almost every day but i just didn't know how am i going to get to achieve my dream then when i get to campus i see people having the same mentality right that's when i knew that i had to be different now that's what success is all about success is all about not following what masses are saying it's not following what masses are doing it's all about being yourself just be yourself bro be yourself let you must, they must say you are crazy to show that you are on the right path you must do something which they don't understand just to show that you're on the right uh, right path because nonetheless you can you can't be listening to to advices from the same people you are struggling with every day 
I'm not saying you shouldn't. Sometimes when it comes to money and success, it doesn't work like that. You must be different. Think out of the box. Think out of the comfort zone. Like I always say, when I, when I was studying, I was daydreaming all the time. When I was wearing my, 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 my push-ins to the campus, every day I was daydreaming. I was seeing myself as this top person in life. But the problem, I just didn't know which industry. But all I ever wanted was to be a DJ, was to be a musician, a producer. But things didn't go my way, you know. It's tough when you don't have money. I'm telling you guys, it's tough when you don't have money. When you have money, the treatment is not the same. The treatment, it's not the same, trust me. You need to have money to be taken serious in life. If you don't have money, you will see. Once the, once the virus gets to affect the whole country, if it does, you will see the, the what I'm talking about. How people with money will be treated won't be the same as how a person from Alex Lime Cooking will be treated. The treatment won't be the same. <laughs> Who are you going to blame? The government. Come on, guys. You guys are too old to be relying on the government all the time. I, I see you guys always swearing at the government. The, the government can only do a, a certain part. They, 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 can't, they can't make you successful. You know, the problem is with us as, as youth is that we, we want to blame the government for everything. Come on, guys. We must, you must get out of your comfort zone. You must do things which, you, things which people don't understand. You must risk and You must get out of your comfort zone. Look at how you are afraid to lose your job. Today your company is going to get closed because of a virus you don't even know where it comes from. And then now you are not even going to get money. What's going to happen to your bills month end? What's going to happen to you month end? You know? But had you taken a risk at some point, and when I talk about risking, people always refer it and link it to Forex. Nah, I'm not talking about Forex, bro. I'm talking about anything which you might be in love with. I'm talking about your passion, bro. Something only that you understand. I mean, like, come on, let's use common sense. Let's use common sense. So many people in this country, I'm not going to talk about the world. So many people in this country, how is it, what do you expect when all of us are going to, to school? The system has been taking us that route all the time. Everyone, one route, everyone. But one thing I thank school for is that it opened my brains. Because when I got to varsity, that's when I realized that I oh, fuck man. I deserve better than this. And how do you know that you deserve better than this? Just take a look at your surroundings. Just take a look at your surroundings. The answer is not far. Just take a look at your surroundings. You know, when I was still studying, I would take a look. I would go on campus. I would look at the lectures, how they live their lives, where they stay, what kind of cars they drive. Right? After that, I would look at teachers, where they live, the kind of cars they drive. You know? I would look at various careers. Then I sit down and I'm like, you know what? This is not for me. I deserve better. Till when are you going to be posting people's cars on social media? Trust me, with that mentality, uh, <laughs> your dreams, this virus will even find you and kill you before you even achieve your dreams. I'm telling you, I'm telling you, your wealth, your wealth, black child, is locked within your talent. Some of you guys can dance, some of you guys can sing, some of you guys are great artists in terms of drawing, you know, some of you guys are handy guys, you guys have different talents, some of you guys are modelers, but you don't follow that passion, you're following this thing which the system wants you to follow, what do you think is going to happen to you? Riz <laughs> 
if you don't risk you know i was i was at propaganda ne? i was at propaganda this past sunday yesterday uh, for my gig so we were attending a convoy right uh, yesterday propaganda so we we're attending a convoy now before the convoy i met this old timer Oban, I met this old timer. I didn't know him, you know. Uh, ah, he greeted me very. Uh, we talked about life a bit, you know. And all of a sudden, this timer tells me that you know what, son. Eh? Uh, I didn't know that he. Okay, maybe he knew what I was doing because I was wearing forex t-shirt. Maybe that's how he knew what I was doing, you know. It's like you know, Ntanagane. One thing I want you to know about life is that. People will always talk. You can see I'm old, but even today they still talk about me, you know? And when I look at this timer, this timer is wearing biker clothes. He's a biker, you know? In my mind, I thought, okay, this timer came with a bike because he's wearing biker clothes. And then he's like, you, you see even me right now, all these guys that you see here, when they come to me, they smile, but behind my back, they talk. And then I ask him, why do they talk? And then he's like, did you see the Porsche outside? I'm like, yeah. He's like, yeah, that's my car. I'm like, what? So you came with a Porsche, yeah. And then others came with bikes, yet still you're a biker. And then he said, yes. The reason why they talk is because they know that they won't get to my level. You know, they won't get to my level. And they won't get to my level because they are afraid of risking. I've taken so many risks, you know. And when he's saying that, it makes sense coming to think of how I've taken risk in my risks in my life. You know, how, how, how I got to, I'm, I'm only 24 years turning 25 this year. But the risks that I'm ta I've, I've taken in my life, even a 50-year-old still failed to take them today because they want to feel comfortable. Comfort kills people. You, 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 you can't be comfortable forever. You can't, I, I always get bored when I look at people's statuses. They're always posting cars they will never drive, houses they will never stay in, only because of one thing, about risk. They are not risky. You can't be dreaming about this yet still doing the opposite. Work towards your dream. Work to risk, Antoana. What people say doesn't work. Make it work. Make it work. I can assure you. I can assure you. Whatever, whatever people say about you on social media or behind your back, in real life, nobody's going to say anything. I've seen it. Even today, not even one person has came to me and told me crap. Even today. Why? Because how do you touch a G63 and make me open my window just to tell me nonsense? You can't. You can't. You can't. It's impossible. So these people only say these things online, right? So when they do that, just make sure that you work under carpet. The reason why I'm talking too much today, the reason why I'm, conf I'm confidently showing you my MetaTrader 4 is because regardless of what any person can say about me nothing can ever be taken away from me it's only god only god can take what he has given uh, from me but not not a human a human cannot do anything to me they can't do nothing to me risk and plan being comfortable doesn't doesn't help anymore you know it's, it's good. It's good that you're going to work. It's good that you're going to school. But what about your dreams? Till when are you going to say congratulations to others? Eh? Till when? Langkushi Shamar. So, I hope Lengwil, I hope you guys heard me. Uh, the world is a cruel place. You know, life doesn't get easy on anybody doesn't get easy. Even Lena. Even me. This other day I lost... Uh, actually, I never... I, I wanted to tell FBK students about it. 
this other day I lost uh, I lost about 3.8 I lost about 3.8 million. Uh, let me try to look for for the thing here. Yeah. I lost about 3.8 million, right? Uh, but me losing that amount of money was not actually I was not supposed to lose. Uh, what happened was that big papa, you know, you know, big papa just did something that I was not supposed to do. Uh, I'm trying to to look for the trade. You know, uh, I lost about 3.8. Uh, I'm trying to look for the trade here. Uh, where is it? Okay, let me try custom period. Uh, where is it? 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 No, I'm not winning here. Uh, the nine. Okay. Okay, I think I'm fine. I'm winning here. Oh yeah. Here yeah, I lost I lost about uh, I lost about three point eight. You know? I lost about three point eight here. Uh, it's hundred thousand uh, USD. It's 140,000 USD, right? But I want you guys to understand. Né? I want you guys to understand. The, the money that I've lost here, I was not supposed to, to lose it, basically. I was not supposed to lose it. I only lost it because I, I became greedy. You know, I became greedy. And it's not a train smash. Uh, the reason why I'm telling you this is because I want you to see that even today, even today, as much as I still get to stay in these nice houses, get to drive these nice cars, this thing ain't easy on anybody. It's not easy on anyone. You see, I lost about $241,000, uh, which is equivalent to... Let's see how much is it. 241,000 USD. But I want you guys to understand. Me losing this amount of money does not mean that I can't trade. Actually, it's, it's, it's about four. Actually, it's about four because... But last, 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 not quite, last time I checked, it was about 3.8 to 9. Because of the coronavirus and the... The currencies are changing from time to time. Uh, the markets are getting affected, you know. So, yeah, I lost about this. Just not long ago. When, when was the date? Uh, the 9, 9 March. 9 March, not long ago. 9 March, just about a week ago. I lost about this much, right? I lost this much. But the reason why I'm not worried the reason why I'm not worried much is because I know I'm going to make this back. And I know with you guys by my side, with you guys looking up to me, I'm going to do miracles. And I know the reason why I lost this money was because I'm, I was greedy. Truth be told, you see this, this, this loss here, I was on a profit of about 30000 I was on a profit of about thirty to thirty-five thousand uh, after claiming. Actually, I was not trading; I was claiming, right? <laughs> so I could have closed on thirty thousand dollars profit, but I just let it slide because I wanted to make so much more. You know, I wanted to make so much more money. I wanted to make more money, but uh, things actually didn't go according to my plan. You know. Things didn't go according to my plan. So, but nonetheless, this is nothing. Uh, because after losing the 4M, I've managed to at least recover a portion of it, you know. I've managed to recover a portion of it. So I'm showing you this, this dark side of trading. So that when you lose money, when you lose money, you don't, you don't necessarily think of giving up. You know?
because just in case, in case if you didn't know, just before you celebrate, because I know not everybody is on this live video for a good cause. Some already are laughing, uh, saying, ah, he lost four million. Hey, in case you didn't know, I still have this. In case you didn't know. If you are a witch watching this right now, in case you didn't know, I still have this. Right? And let's see. I still have this in case you didn't know. Just before you celebrate. I lost I lost four and then I still have about this. Just don't give up. Just don't give up, guys. This thing is not easy. And it's even worse for, for people like me because I have to test things using my own money, you know, before it could come back to you guys. Just before you celebrate, you witch, I still have this. Just before you, you celebrate, I still have this, you witch. I know. Let's, let's see how much this is. Let's see how much this is. So by 2020, I want to be one of the greatest investors ever. Don't, don't give up. Don't give up, guys. <laughs> These things are it's not easy. We make it look easy, but it's not, eh? You just see us laughing, smiling, but it's tough. You know, it's tough. Had I not lost uh, my, 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 my 4M, I would have been far, you know? So, but nonetheless, I have a goal. I have a goal I have to reach. Uh, I have this big business idea that I want to invest in, you know, and I need, I need money. I'm trying to raise funds, you know, uh, I won't necessarily uh, tell you guys because it's always bad to announce your plans right in front of my, en your enemies, because I know majority of you guys don't really like me. You're just following me because you want to have my life. Alenil as well. Alenil. And some of you guys are just following me just to see the day I fall. Alenil. Agifilun. Little of an amasip. Little of an amasip as well. Agifilu. So I have this, uh, this big business idea. Uh, it's a multi million project uh, that I want to invest in, you know. Uh, I'm actually done with buying useless things like cars, you know. I used to buy cars because I wanted people to see that this thing is real. But if you are all about living your life just to prove to people over and over and over, it's going to affect you. Because I can assure you right now, when they say a car is not an asset, I learned that the hard way. I learned that the hard way. Because once one car breaks down, jiggy jiggy it wants a new engine. Do you know how much is an engine? Do you know how much is a gearbox? You know? So I had to let go some of uh, the other cars because now they were becoming an expense. Example, the A45. It broke down and then Benz, I paid about 182000 to Benz. I think I even made a video about it uh, in 2018. The A45, I paid about 180000 you know, because the maintenance could, couldn't cover it. So, these cars were actually becoming more liabilities, you know. As you know, a car is not an asset. So, I've driven cars, I've driven cars, I... I'm actually satisfied now, you know. So now I'm all about investing. So what I do is I liquidize all the expenses and then turn them into assets. Obviously, I won't tell you guys. So the reason why I'm, I'm, I'm just alerting you is because I want you guys to understand, true followers, everyone else can fuck off. I'm talking, about my, I'm talking to my true followers. Is I want you guys to understand that I'm, I'm switching... Uh, from I'm turning liabilities into assets. You understand? Now, the process of doing that is not going to be easy. The process of doing that is going to be having uh, people talk bad things about me and so forth. But I want you guys to understand that there's a reason why I'm doing what I'm doing. You understand? There's 
the reason why I'm doing what I'm doing, you know? So anything which is an expense in my life, I'm selling, 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 and then I'm diversifying. It's called, is it diversifying? Yeah, you know? Because you can never know what tomorrow holds, you know? As much as I think, as much as I think that I have money in my MT4, tomorrow, tomorrow I can wake up with nothing, you know? So, as much as I want you guys to be trading Forex, you must understand that this thing comes with lots of risks, right? Lots of risking and, yeah, basically, it comes with lots of risks. And you must take Forex as a source of capital, you know? It can be your mainstream of income, yes, but you must you must actually take capital from Forex and invest in various businesses. I've, I've learned that the hard way, you know. I've bought so many cars, you know, you know me. And me not buying a car now does not mean that I cannot afford to buy a car. I'm just tired of proving a point to you guys. I'm just tired of proving a point to poor people, you know. Those who believe will believe, man, you know. I've done my part. Those who don't believe, you can forsake, you can fuck off. It doesn't make any difference. My life won't change, you know. But all I do, all I'm all about, what my life is all about is just to inspire, you know, just to inspire. Just to inspire those who look up to me because I know it gets tough. So hearing things like this, at least you can actually get to have hope that, okay, I can do it as well someday, you know, someday. So, nonetheless, uh, thank you guys for, for watching me on this live video. Instagram is going to be kicking us very, very soon. So, nonetheless, I hope you are inspired, guys. I hope you are inspired. This graph is the future. And with the situation that's happening right now, the good part about it is that you can still trade indoors. You know, you don't have to go anywhere to do this kind of a job. And you don't have to, to have a lot of money to actually make money. You just need to be smart. You just need to be smart. Use your brain. Just be smart. You know, because the truth is you only... Majority of you guys only followed me because you've seen me buying cars, you've seen me in different houses, you've, you know, if it was not because of that, you wouldn't have followed me, right? Now, that simply means that for you to follow me, you had to see something from me. You had to see me making it at some point. You have to hear people talking about me at some point. And you did, and then now you're here. Right? Now, I was alone all this time. I had to achieve all those things without anybody's support. Meaning that sometimes your excuse is useless. Sometimes your, school, your excuse is like, Coach, I'm not making it because you're not giving me your attention. That's useless, bro. I've made it without anybody's attention. I've made it without actually being directly inspired by anybody. I was alone, and look at where I am. I took a risk. Just take a risk in whatever that you believe in. Doesn't have to be trading only. Can be music, it can be anything, bro. Take a risk. Take a risk in time. And just maybe five years down the line, two years down the line, Six months down the line, because this success thing does not really have a, a duration. Because it's four years I've been trading. Oh, on the fourth, is it the fourth? No, actually on the 2nd of April this year, on the 2nd of April, I'll be celebrating four years. Four years of full trading, you know. And I've learned so much. I know the market in and out. And even if I had to be broke today because of some reasons, the one thing which nobody can ever take